Hello, I am Scribbles the Juggalo. And what am I doing, Magnet? I don't fucking even know. You don't know what I'm doing. You don't know why you're filming me. Yeah, I haven't even said a damn word. Because I didn't want you to know, or you wouldn't have done it. I probably well, this have. is a Juggalo stand-up routine. Comedy joke. Oh, God. <laughs> That's right. So anyway, and I wrote these in about five minutes. So what's the deal with the Axe Murder Boys? First, they're uh, signed in 2006, I believe. And they're on Psychopathic Records for a long time. Whatever year it is now, 2011. And then all of a sudden... You, know, you can't get the, you go to the fucking hatchet gear, you can't get the merchandise, uh, and uh, they kind of disappeared. You go to the Axe Murder Boys, uh, you know, on hatchet gear, and you press it, and you get some other bullshit. What's the deal with that? Um, Violent J, or Shaggy says, it's a mutual agreement between the Axe Murder Boys and Psychopathic to leave the record company. Mutual, like uh, when I got fired for stealing fifty dollars out of the drawer at Arby's, uh, that kind of mutual agreement. Alrighty, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> but now, they call that a rim shot. Yes. Okay. Also, uh, what's the deal with these people? This is part of my stand up here. What's the deal with, with people with Bluetooths? You know, you you're walking down the street and you see someone talking and you think. You know, and then you realize, well, they're not, they're not uh, crazy, they're, they're talking to them, they're not talking to themselves, they're talking to someone on the phone, or they're, you think they're talking to you for a minute, you turn your head, and uh, they got a Bluetooth in their ear, and they're talking to the person on the phone. I mean, it used to be in the, uh, you know, a few years ago, uh, the only people that talked to themselves were homeless people, you know, so you, could, you knew the crazy people from the normal people. Now... You know, I've seen homeless people with Bluetooth, and that really blows your fucking mind when you see a homeless person with a Bluetooth, because you know they're crazy, and they're talking to some, they're they're talking to themselves, and they're talking to someone on the phone. Anyway, all right, and my final finale here: What's the deal with cancer and AIDS? That's some fucked up shit. Cancer it eats your body from the inside out, and AIDS destroys your immune system and kills you. What's the deal with that? Anyway, I'd like, in conclusion, I'd like to do a weather report. Currently, it's a very warm, balmy night. Temperature in Denver, Colorado is a warm 85 degrees at 9.30 at night to 10 o'clock at night. Very warm, very warm in Denver, which is where we're at. Over here in Detroit, I don't know much about it. I know ICP's from Detroit. And I believe the weather is currently 79 degrees. And there's a time difference there. Don't ask me what time it is in Detroit. Key West is still right here and very, very, what is it? <laughs> so we have a lot of moisture coming up from the Gulf right now, mixing with the dip in the, what do we call this again? Jet stream. Thank you. I was testing you. I really did forget that. In the dip in the jet, jet stream, which uh, if we had some low pressure, we would have a good chance at getting rain in Denver. But we're not going to get rain in Denver because it is very hot and it never rains in Denver. So the, t the forecast for tomorrow will be in Denver, Colorado. It will be what, Magnet? Hot as fuck. Dry. As fuck, and Tim's are in Detroit tomorrow. Hot and muggy as fuck. You know what I'm saying? And of course, Tim's are in Key West. Gay as fuck. What about up in like the, uh, the Boston tonight? area? Sorry. What about up in Boston? It's also in Boston, Massachusetts. It is also hot. Hot. H O T as a. Oh my god, I'm retarded tonight. Anyway, we get the point. Thank you for throwing the Boston thing in just to fuck me up at the last minute. That's our forecast for tonight. And, uh,.
tune in my next video. Fuck you, Home Depot. I have a video, fuck you, Walmart, and I'm working on video, fuck you, Home Depot, and the next juggalo stand-up routine. Turn it off.